Hi everyone, I am Matteo Collina, I am Technical Director at Nearform. I am also a member of the Node.js Technical Steering Committee and one of the end of the OpenJS Cross Project Council. However, I'm here today because I am also one of the lead developers of Fastify, uh, which just recently joined the uh, OpenJS Foundation as an incubation project. What is Fastify? Fastify is a, a web framework for Node with the focus, with a strong focus on uh, performance and developer experience at the same time. Because we think that you should not really compromise, uh, you know, the developer experience to achieve the best performance that you can get from Node.js. And Fastify offers a very low overhead, uh, an extremely low overhead web framework compared to Node Core. Essentially, if it your application will run as fast as Node, as Node can, with very as, as, as little impact impossible, um, as possible in your uh, in your application. So anyway, what is Fastify? Um, so Fastify provides. It's, 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 we started Fastify in 2016, and I was. It was uh, back then. I was thinking of building a web framework. Uh, for now, because I was not really happy with the, the ecosystem, how the way of the ecosystem was going. And however, I started it with a very specific thing in mind. I started it saying, well, the first thing I need to do to do a web framework is to find some other contributors to work with me on this, on this insane path. Because, you know, writing a web framework, considering all the complexity of, uh, complexities of HTTP, it's a gargantuan task. It's insane. So I wanted to build a community first. So Fastify was born as a community rather than uh, an open source project. And it was structured like that at the beginning. And this is why it fits into the uh, OpenJS uh, model of open governance and open collaboration, because it, it was built as a community first. It was not built as a um, it was not built as, as an open source project built in by me and pushed out to the world. It was built, okay, let's welcome people, okay? We need to be, it needs to be everybody's framework. Because one of the key problem in maintenance and long-term stability of a project is on uh, making sure that, you know, onboarding new collaborators and making sure that the load of maintaining the full project is spread among as much as, as much people as possible and as much companies as possible. So it's a big circle, you see, you, need to, you know, I expect if somebody wants to adopt Fastify and use Fastify in their system, I expect them to send contribution back to the project because I'm not solving their bugs for them. Like, okay, minus one thing. I work for Nearform, we are a professional services company, so I'm definitely happy to fix your bugs in Fastify, but you know, you need to pay money, sorry. And if you want, if you would like to contribute to the project and so on and help out to grow, you're more than welcome to. In fact, that's the preferred way. So if you are a bug, if you have a problem, I want you to join. And this, is, this has impacted the framework so much and we were able to grow in adoption and in, in, in what the framework does because of this contribution model. Still maintaining a principle of, fast perf of, of performance and developer experience. And it's, it's been doing great. The framework is growing is going rapidly. Compl companies are using all the, all the world. Um, I just want to give a big shout out to the other lead developer, which is Thomas de la Vedova, who joined with me this crazy adventure in 2016. And you know, it's, we never, nobody, none of us could actually predict what would, how this will grow and not grow us. We just said, well, we want to build, it just came to me and said, ask me, hey, Matt, I want to get into open source. Okay, would you like to build a wireframe with me? And that, that was that. That was it, and we just started. Uh, two years, like three years later, we've got you know two major releases out. We are pushing out Fastify 3 in a few months, and things are doing pretty well. So things are. Great.